Well, here we are at last, people. The end of the line for WandaVision, and yeah, I don't want this show to to end, considering how I've loved the show week after week, and it's just kept me captivated, but everything ends, and it's always sad, but everything begins again, and that's always happy, so... Especially with next week, we're starting uh, Falcon and the Winter Soldier. But WandaVision. <laughs> Hello, everyone. Liam Catterson here. And yeah, this is the uh, finale of WandaVision as we're on episode nine. And yeah, sadness is there because of the fact that we do not want to lose uh, the show. We want to keep watching it until the end of time essentially but uh it is going to be pretty exciting to see how we do close things off with wandavision because there's a lot of stuff we got to get through um on how we're going to deal with agatha um white vision as well and the potential trauma that we're still going to suffer with uh wanda having to uh potentially encounter white vision um this is as well the same vision that she had to kill so that's great um but also losing the vision that we've spent time with in wonder vision as well so yeah um but yeah agatha vision hopefully hayward gets his ass kicked so that would be just the cherry on top please um as well as how we're going to potentially lead into multiverse of madness i am expecting doctor strange to show up whether it be within the episode or after the episode and whatnot there's also Quicksilver um, that we've got to deal with as well. Um, I don't think Mephisto is going to show. <laughs> um, unless, you know, they do something like they did with Avengers, where you had Thanos, who, of course, was teased to have greater importance. And we not all know how that played out. So maybe they could do something like that with Mephisto. Um, make him, like, I guess the main big bad for, like... Um, for the uh, fourth phase, but um, we'll just have to wait and see. Just keep him away from Spider-Man, because we're not having one more day. No way. So, yeah. Um, but, yeah, I am excited to see how things do play out. Um, there's a, Like I said, there's a lot riding into this uh, final episode. And, you know, I expect the show to go out with a bang because, like I said, week after week, it's just been captivating. They, they, they've they, never missed a beat, in my opinion. And I, and, and that fills me with so much confidence that this finale is going to deliver. So, with that said, let's get into the final episode of WandaVision. This is episode nine. Let's go. So why don't you surrender your magic to someone who knows what to do with it? Give her time and she'll this pathetic little corner of the wipe world all to yourself. the floor with you. What do you say? Holy shit! What? Is it him? No, 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 no. Mm, no. And I was told you were powerful. Oh, sh- <laughs> Vision versus Vision! Vision. This is our home. Then let's fight for it. Oh, this is gonna be great. Oh, this is so good. This is so much better than them facing against sword. Probably have something to say about your plan when they arrive inside the hour. Oh, oh, he ate. <laughs> Jimmy Woo. We're done here. Hey, what you're gonna, you're gonna get absolutely Done it. Flourish. Me magic. Your power exceeds that of the Sorcerer Supreme. It's 
your destiny to destroy the oh, world. Oh shit. Well I'm not destinies can be rewritten. I am. Oh really? Oh, oh, oh. You found a Steven Seagal? Oh? Ra Wait. Wait. Agnes doesn't live here. What? You do. You're Ralph! You're Ralph Boner? Boner. <laughs> What? If you won't let us go, just let us die. Please. I will. I will let you go. This is. I will. This is sad. Use your power and do it now. Heroes don't torture people. Oh. Yeah, I was gonna say, what's gonna happen with this vision if the hex is... Oh, oh boy. To this twisted world, and now one can't exist without the other. Save Westview or save your family. Oh my goodness. Wonder. Oh my goodness. Look at them! Look! Not based! Listen, boys. Your mother and I never really prepared you for this. But you were born for it. <laughs> Let's go! <laughs> I'm ready! I'm loving this! Go boy! Oh drop dead! You Whoa! Kill Monica! Waste him! I like yours too. <laughs> oh look at this coward driving off because he knows his ass is gonna get kicked ten thousand times and beyond. Darcy! familiar with the thought experiment the ship of Theseus in the field of ice with new planks. Where the original <coughs> plank remains, is it still the ship of Theseus? Hmm. Secondly, if those removed planks are restored and reassembled free of the rot, is that is himself? I have not retained memories. Oh my but goodness. You do have the data. It this is merely being kept from That's it. Wow. I love this. Here he is. I have vision. Yeah, you are. Oh, that was brilliant. I loved that. Which is just, oh my goodness, this is, oh, this is masterful. Roots. In a given space, only the witch who cast them can use her magic. <laughs> Thanks for you to tell me. Who? I am. Holy shit! <laughs> Let's go! Holy shit! Holy shit! Look at her! 
Look at her! You have... You have no idea what you've unleashed. You're gonna need me. If you can, I do. You can keep trying to corner her. To find you. Wait, 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 wait. Wow. Wonder. Hiya, hun. Oh, man. Boys. Thanks for choosing me to be your mom. Oh, yeah, I'm done. Okay. Are the piece of the mind stone that lives in me. Oh, oh, oh. You are a copy of wires and blood and bone. That Oh my <laughs> Oh my heart Goodbye before So it stands to reason Oh, my goodness. <clears throat> so long, darling. Oh, she's standing in the same spot when she created. I don't understand this power. But I will. This is your journey's beginning, really, to to the Scarlet Witch. Goodbye, Monica. Bye, Wanda. Oh, that costume, though. Good luck. <sighs> oh shit! You've been grounded. He'd like to meet with you. Where? Is this Talo so Nick or is this Nick? <sighs> Scrolls in I, well this is gonna set things up with um Well I, I'm not sure if Captain uh, uh, probably Captain Marvel 2. Um because there is of course that connection um with the scrolls with Nick with uh, Carol with Maria and Monica. And this can open the gateway. Surely. Um, I'm going to see if there's any other. I'm not sure if there is, but there's all, it's always best to check, isn't there? Oh, I think there is. Okay, hang on. Right. So, there is another. Um... Okay, so let's do this. Oh, shit. Oh. Not what I was expecting, but I will take it. Oh. Okay, so yeah, that was the, that was brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. I think I might have uh, got teary-eyed. I don't know how many times I got teary-eyed. I've lost count, really, <laughs> after um, the final departure with the boys and, and Vision and, yeah. But... Yeah, definitely, definitely not disappointed with that. That was bloody, bloody excellent. <sighs> oh, yeah, like I said, that was a really, 
really wonderful way to conclude um WandaVision. I just really absolutely enjoyed that. There were just so many great moments. And I literally have no idea how many times I cried during that episode, but especially the ending that really hit me in the gut. It was just emotional all around. Like, I even got emotional seeing the suit. That suit is so, 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 so good. And yeah, I just, yeah. Whew. Um. Yeah. The battle with Wonder and Agatha was just really go uh, good all throughout. Even the start was just wonderful. The way that she just flung that car at Agatha, of course, that wasn't going to be the be all end all, but it was still impressive. Um, just to just to see her like bamf her like that. But I think I think the elephant in the room has to be um, where Agatha played herself, essentially, by teaching her about um, the runes in the last episode. That was her downfall. That was the beginning of her downfall. Her overconfidence was her weakness. And it certainly was because there was no way Wanda was like giving everything to her without consequence. and. Yeah, but just the way she emerged with her suit was just so glorious. It It is so amazing. And yeah. And uh, there is the door left open for Agatha to return. But I don't know. I don't think, you know, it might be feasible with the prison that Wanda has put her in. So, um, yeah, but... um. It seems like with that um, post credit scene as well, um, it seems like she is trying to look for a way to bring her children back, which can lead to multiverse of madness. Like she can scour through the um, um, multiverse to um, find her children alive in another universe. Uh, especially since we had Ralph, who, of course, in another universe is Quicksilver. And it seems like he wasn't pulled from this universe, but it does, it, it seems a bit off, doesn't it? Like how you cast someone who belongs in another universe, all for like essentially a boner joke. Um, I would never have pegged Fietro, I guess, to be Ralph whatsoever. That was one that like that was that was I guess one of the leading questions who is Ralph because everyone thought it was Mephisto and um yeah Mephisto wasn't even a matter of concern for one division um but the fact that Ralph was yeah the fact that Ralph was um Pietro or Fietro whatever Evan Peters. Yeah, that just... Okay. So... But... It was just really, really good. And uh, the Monica bit, I think, is setting up for um, Captain Marvel 2, especially if um, that was Nick Fury that the scroll was referring to. I think it was, most likely. You know, organized recruiting for S.W.O.R.D. Um... So, uh, like, um, especially since, like I said, there's that, there's those ties with Captain Marvel, with Carol, with Nick, then you've got the scroll, so, uh, and he is putting, uh, charges of sorts, so, it, it would be like the Avengers, wouldn't it? Like, the Avengers initiative, like, how he approached, uh, Tony, um, he will do so with Monica, recruit her for sword, so, yeah. Um, but yeah, it was so good. Just, just that final battle. And this is it though. I feel like the battles in this were really great. Even the vision battle, because I have to say the way they executed that without like 
resorting to one destroying the other was brilliant. Like, the fact that you have them to uh, basically resolve their fight over a philosophical question was just really, really great. Like, them mentioning about the ship of Thesis and, you know, um, comparing that to themselves, which one is the true vision, because you have um, vision that Wanda created, who has no memories before Westview, so he has no me memories of, you know, the MCU, and you have this vision, who is... His, who has his memory suppressed, who has been tasked to take down Wanda and is completely different with the white vision. It, you know, it, you make them reflect on um, who is the true vision. And it's so, so good. Like you have that comparison to the ship of thesis and I guess you compare the rot to their memories with, you know, the rot homing the experience, etc. Um, it was just so, it was just so appropriate that, you know, you have someone as sophisticated and someone, um, like Vision resolve, um, a fight with a version of himself in a philosophical manner. It's a very appropriate, like, you don't need, um, you know, beams and whatnot and, and punches trades to resolve a fight. And that's what makes this um outcome really, really amazing because they they resolved their fight in the most appropriate way uh, possible. Not just that, though, but it seems like there is the door open for Vision to return in the MCU, it seems. Um, contrary to what we feared, because we feared we'd lose vision twice like with um white vision and um of course vision from the hex we we, we assumed that anyways because uh with the hex we saw what happened with vision so yeah um but it seems like not even thanos can stop uh vision because he's still alive of course i feel like he's going to do some kind of um thinking now that um you had vision unlock his memories and um contemplate everything with the way he just shot out and was uh, after he regained his memories uh, and affirming that he is vision uh he's probably going to do some thinking but there is the door open for vision to return it seems so it will be interesting to see how that happens uh maybe we'll just have to wait and see if wanda can uh will encounter him at some point maybe who knows because now he knows who he is. So, yeah. Um, but Monica as well was just great, especially sacrificing well, herself for the children. Because... Fucking Hayward. I gotta say, no hesitation whatsoever. That dickhead shot at children. I mean, you know, he is just giving us more and more like it's 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 like bingo for him let let's list off all the reasons we can p piss off the audience and of course the last thing he does is shoot at children very swiftly as well yeah i'm glad that darcy rammed into him and had a sassy amazing self just flaunt at him so i was personally hoping that we'd have a line of like everyone who's appeared in one division beat the shit out of like a piñata basically i would have loved to have seen that but you know what what he's gonna get is yeah he he's get he's going to jail so enjoy that biatch so yeah but the the fact that he didn't have a second to contemplate. Do I shoot children or not? He just went for it. He just went for it. Yeah. So, but it was really nice to see, like, Monica, um, give her proof, uh, give Wanda proof that she was on her, her side, um, by saving her children. And, yeah.
um, helping uh, wander out. So I I do have a feeling we're going to see them two okay. encounter each other once more, especially like with a new Avengers lineup, potentially. I don't know. But um, I feel like them two are destined to meet again. Um, so, yeah. Um, I also loved little bits like Jimmy and the handcuffs. That was great. Um, especially him shit talking Hayward as well. So that was uh, really, really great. The moment where Agatha was torturing Wanda as well, um, especially with all the residents uh, begging for death, that was very, very morbid. And just seeing the stress rise for Wanda was just powerful. Like, um, this is great, though, with the fact that Agatha seemed like she had control. But in the end... um, you know, her flaunting to wander, especially with the uh, runes, that became her weakness. And uh, yeah, that final suit is just a work of art. Like, whew. Yeah. Um, so it was just really, really great stuff to see, you know, the, the battle play out the way it did, like between Wanda and Agatha. Um, especially since, you know, she was giving these Tudor-esque statements to Wanda. And um, in the end, the learner uh, overcame the master. So because that's it. She, she, um, there was one bit though that, really has my um that really has me excited and it's the fact that um wanders told that her power exceed, uh, exceeds the sorcerer supreme so that is that is um yeah that is pretty pretty like strange is is done and uh affirmation that strongest avenger goes to uh or powerful uh avenger should i say goes to wanda because dang so but yeah um it is very very concerning with her going into the dark hold which um i think a lot of spec uh, speculation was thrown around there with episode 7 um and uh, that was confirmed in this episode um even having an entire chapter devoted to to wonder so yeah this is only the beginning of the journey of the scarlet witch because this is it we've had wonder but now Wanda is embracing the Scarlet Witch. This is the beginning of her journey, the Scarlet Witch, which is really brilliant. Like, I am really glad that this show ended with the beginning of the Scarlet Witch. And I am really excited to see Wanda again, how powerful um, she is going to become now. <laughs> um, yeah. It's a whole new world, and I'm here for it. So, yeah, but that was a really great way to conclude WandaVision. Honestly, it was really beautiful. Um, I had a feeling that this um, finale would not um, would not skip a beat as well, like the rest of the show has. And I was right. The show was brilliant right until the very final second of the post-credits as well included. Um... It was just really emotional. It was just really exciting. I was just... I was just being fed in that episode. And yeah, it was brilliant. So what an amazing way to conclude an amazing show. So yeah. But um, uh, yeah, I will see you guys next time. Hope you guys enjoyed this reaction. You can check my videos on the right. If you want to check out more of my content, you can also subscribe to Mammy Beans and channel if you want to. Hope you guys enjoyed this reaction. Hope you guys take care and I will see you guys next time. Toodles!